Congratulations, your um, February's manager of the month. Thank you very much. That will reflect well on yourself and the team. How pleasing is that? Yeah, it's a great honor, obviously, in this league to to get um, recognized that way. And uh, thank you very much for the team uh, and the staff that uh, they are always supporting and, and making us better. Can I ask if you're a superstitious man? Depends. <laughs> because manager... You, you, no, because I won it and then we won many games, so that superstition is gone. No, so because you played in March already. So when, when did you actually find out that you'd won it? Yesterday, well, no, when you take it. Okay, so there was... That's no, okay? There was no, no, because <laughs> you played in March already and you've won, so the manager of the month curse is gone. Okay, perfect. So then it's a positive superstition then that we're going to so win on Saturday. Good. <laughs> okay, uh, Simon? Yeah, can I just ask, just put this on football aside, just on... Like a human level, given you know your relationship with Aaron and what he'd done in terms of this rebuild and the project, how difficult it has been for you to sort of give him less minutes, given the connections he's had with you and people. Yeah, sure. The connection in the personal level, I think it goes both ways very much. I'm really um, happy uh, to make the call that uh, that I made, and, and we made as a club as well to sign him uh, because it was very controversial to start with. So. Um, we helped a lot to change his career in a really powerful way, and I'm really happy that he came here and um, and he's done what he's done for us so far. And in terms of the sort of summer and people talk a lot about, has there been any sort of plans to sit down and talk with him about what's going to happen in the summer, or are you trying to fully focus on? Now is the season. Now is tomorrow. Now is what we've done today. How we can improve for tomorrow? And uh, those talks are for for much uh, after I think.